Hey guys, today we're going to learn the orbital periods of each planet. Don't forget to watch my other previous videos on planets. So what is an orbital period? An orbital period is the amount of time given to a planet takes to complete one orbit around the sun. So here we have Mercury, which is 58 million kilometers away from the sun. It's three light minutes away from the sun. And the orbital period is 88 days. So here we have Venus, which is 108 million kilometers away from the sun. And it's six light minutes away from the sun. Its orbital period is 225 days. Now we have our home planet Earth, which is 150 million kilometers away from the sun. It's 8.3 light minutes away. And its orbital period is 365 days. Now we go on to Mars. Mars is 20, 228 million kilometers away from the sun. It's 12.7 light minutes away. And its orbital period is 687 days. Now we're on Jupiter. It's 778 million kilometers away from the sun. It's 43 light minutes away. And its orbital period is 4,333 days or 12 years on planet Earth. Next, we go on to Saturn, the planet of rings. It's 1.43 billion kilometers away from the sun. It's 1.3 light hours. And its orbital period is 29 years. So now we're going on to Uranus, which is 2.87 billion kilometers away. It's 2.7 light hours away. And its orbital period is 84 years. Here we have Neptune, which is 4.5 billion kilometers away. It's 4.2 light hours away. And its orbital period is, drum roll please, 165 years. So now we're going on to the recap. If you guys can see, each planet that gets farther and farther away from the sun, the days get more and more and more. So if we went even beyond, imagine how many 
many years it will take just for one orbit around the sun. So as you can see, the closest planet, Mercury, has the shortest orbital period of 88 days, while Neptune, the farthest planet, has an orbital period of 165 years. Wow, that's a lot. Thanks for watching and also show your support by subscribing my channel and also following me on Facebook and Instagram. Bye bye.